Welcome back out here to your Rockford Ice Hogs broadcast network. Bob Mills being joined right now by forward Tyler Mott. Tyler, you came into the Ice Hogs last season right at the tail end there and made a pretty big impact. Scored a few goals in the regular season, added a couple of more in the playoffs. Now that you've had a little bit of a chance to step back and, and sort of digest the start of your pro career, what are some of your thoughts on the, uh, the way things opened up there in Rockford? Yeah, I was excited to hop in and get a chance there in Rockford the last eight games, um, and I'm excited for the future. I think everyone knows some young guys in the organization are getting a chance. Um, I'm just hoping to be one of those guys that gets an opportunity. And things haven't settled down for you at all this summer. You end your season with the Ice Hogs, and right after that, basically, you head out all the way to Russia to take part in the World Tournament. Uh, Team USA did fairly well in that, uh, in that tournament there. What were your thoughts on getting a chance to, to experience things on that stage? Yeah, I was just excited to get another chance to represent the United States uh, in international competition. Um, it's a good opportunity for me and some of the young guys uh, to get a chance to play with the older guys that have a lot of NHL experience. Um, a lot of learning going on over there from those guys on and off the ice. Um, but it's just another good tournament, a uh, chance to compete against some of the best in the world. You talk about playing against NHL caliber players, guys who have a lot of NHL experience. What are some of the things you can learn from a tournament like that and maybe take into this upcoming season? Yeah, a lot of things. The way they play the game, the style that they play it. Um, a lot of Europeans have a lot of skill. Um, play with uh, the wider ice over there, a lot of speed. Um, I think I, the biggest learning curve for me was how much they value the puck. Um, they, they get the puck and they want to keep it as long as they can. So over the course of the tournament, you spend a little more time without the puck than you're used to in college hockey, and I think um, that was something I learned and something I can use moving forward. You've had a few days now here at Prospect Camp with the Chicago Blackhawks. Notice that, uh, that today's session certainly focused on drills. How do you, you maybe try to, to, to prove what you can do to the coaches when you're in a drill situation as opposed to a scrimmage situation? Yeah, I think it's how you're trying to compete. Um, show the little things you can do, whether it's finishing out the net every time or competing second efforts on pucks. Uh, I think you're just trying to do a little more of the, the little things in a tight area than you can do on a 200-foot game. I know you mentioned it earlier on that there are some opportunities in the Chicago Blackhawks organization right now. And whether you're in Chicago or you find yourself uh, out in Rockford again as you ended the season last year, what are some of the goals that you have uh, on the ice uh, coming up here this season? Yeah, I'm just looking to have fun. Um, enjoy the experience as well as work hard. Um, make my teammates better, um, especially learn my first year, um, the lifestyle and, and how the game's played up and down the ice. Um, so I'm just excited for the opportunity and trying to help and contribute any way I can. Tyler, really appreciate you joining us. Best of luck going forward. Thanks, guys. That's Tyler Mott right here on your Rockford Ice Hogs Broadcast Network.